You are not prepared. Guys, it is me, Tapes, and I'm coming to you guys with a gameplay clip video and thoughts from my inner deepest uh, thoughts in my brain or something. I don't know what it really means, but I'm so glad that you tuned in. Please drop a like, leave a comment about the size of your PP so I can measure and feel better about myself and or sad. Probably the latter one. Yeah, it's not very big. It is very, very average, but but surprisingly white yeah almost transparent <laughs> anyway i'm super good that you guys are here i'm having so much fun with call of duty the title is not clickbait and before we get anywhere yes i've done collaborations with call of duty and activision for 14 years or 13 years or something this fall they didn't go with me they went with some fucking buff swedish influencer that plays counter-strike not a single person in sweden started playing call of duty because of this guy i feel robbed but i'm still here sitting and telling you guys that this call of duty is flipping so fun and addicting i can't stop playing it it is ridiculous i'm doing so many sniping and so many shorts and especially now with the new season that came out it's i don't really care that much for the battle pass you know you get a bunch of guys and i have been gifted black cell from activision at least you know they're still giving me that thanks uh and there's cool characters but the main thing that they came out with that has just it's like they added crack cocaine in this game in my veins i can't stop using this longbow with a jack tyrant aftermarket part and you do that you do weekly challenges to unlock it and i highly recommend unlocking it and trying it if you are an aggressive sniper and or want to have fun to run around because what it comes with is this iron sight on it that just makes it honestly insane and the build is obviously going to be at the end of the video i'm also using the assassin vest so there's no the skulls when i kill anyone and I'm also silent, and I don't pop up on the, on the UAV, which just feels insane. You can be playing 10v10, you can get a flank, you can actually start sniping people, and they won't know where you are unless they see you. It is so goddamn fun. Uh, obviously, you know, Call of Duty, super duper fun. They did put a hefty price tag on this game. What is it, like a billion dollars, $800 or something, which is crazy. It's, if you had Modern Warfare 2 2022, this game should be costing like $20. It should just be like $20. And if you want to buy it come brand new, maybe it should be like $60. But that's why I feel like not enough people are playing this game because it's so goddamn expensive. But it is fun. They even released a new map. You saw one clip earlier that's, uh, that's actually fun. I applaud you. Uh, Activision Sledgehammer, you actually made a new map in Call of Duty that's fun. Like that very, you know, like Modern Warfare 2 uh, 2022, there was what? One map that was good. And now all the maps in, uh, in Modern Warfare 3 that are from Modern Warfare 2 2009 are fun pretty much. And then they made Departures, which is like Terminal 2. So I'm rambling on. This game is just so fun right now. And I have gotten so many clips. And if you want to see more, you guys can check out Shorts. Or I'm just going to do a little bit games like this where I, or videos like this where I find something cool and I show you guys and I just talk a little bit because I'm I'm having so much fun with it. I'm, uh, and I think long, full games, maybe that's a little too much like 2010 or something. You guys had ADHD now. You scrolled Instagram way too much. You guys are barely paying attention now. You're like... Pfft. I wonder what's on TikTok. That's what you're thinking right now. So please don't click out. Uh, please just enjoy the rest of it. It's very, it's almost over. I swear to God. So anyway, before the video ends, a couple of other cool things. I just went to Poland for Katowice. That was dope. I got to uh, see some, a little bit of Counter Strike. I was uh, went there with Acer Predator, and I was had very little time to actually check out some uh, Call of uh, Counter Strike. But it was a really cool trip. Uh, second thing is I signed a contract for an office with two of my comedian friends. So we're actually going to move in there and we're going to build a podcast studio where I'm going to do pods. I think the pod is going to be in Swedish, though, to starting out. But it will be really fun in the future to, have, to do like English episodes on it, at least. So I'll let you guys know once that pops up. What else is new? I'm sitting here drinking some coffee, and uh, currently when I'm recording this, it's Valentine's Day, or as I like to call it, V-Day, Venereal Disease Day, which is a completely different day uh, for a lot of people. But yeah, it's uh, it's really cool. Check out this goddamn gun. Like The build is going to be at the end, and uh, other than that, 
God damn. It's like cracked right now, man. Don't me out. UAV ready to deploy. 